After French President Emmanuel Macron's controversial statement on cross-strait issues in Europe's stance, TVBS commentator Wen Qiyu interviewed Professor Philippe Lacour from the ESSEC Business School in Paris to gain insights. So I think the two of them, uh, between them, they were playing some kind of, you know, um, good cop, bad cop um, a game, you could say, although, you know, politics is no longer a game, if it ever was. Um, so I think, you know, he probably, you know, uh, misspoke, uh, especially mm -hmm. in his interview uh, towards the end of his visits, uh, especially uh, when he said, you know, um, if there was a war in Taiwan, it wouldn't be our war. Lacour explained that Macron's comments reflected the consensus among European countries of not wanting to become embroiled in the escalating tensions between the U.S. and China. I think. Most Europeans, and not just in France, agree that we don't want to be caught in this mm -hmm. uh, new, call it as you like, a Cold War or whatever, or, or conflict, conflictual situation between uh, the PRC and the US. Because ma in, many, in many cases, uh, the Europeans would want to continue to do business with both. The ongoing conflict between the U.S. and China has left European countries reluctant to pick sides, especially with the ongoing Russia-Ukraine war. Europe is possibly looking to China to help resolve the situation. However, China's increasing military threats to Taiwan have caused concerns for Europe. The drills, the military uh, uh, exercises yeah. that took place last August and again recently, all of this is sort of adding to the to the uh, uh, sort of sympathy. Um, yeah. sympathy and the fact, you know, generally China's reputation is not very good, really, in, yeah. in, in, yeah. in Europe and in France especially. Lacour, who was formerly stationed in Taiwan as a French correspondent, revealed that many in France have an affinity for Taiwan and it remains a good partner in educational and economic exchanges. Despite this, business opportunities with Taiwan remain limited, and Lacour believes that it's challenging to determine France's true stance toward China in global politics. Wen Qiyu, Xu Xiaoyu, Vivian Xiao, TVBS World Taiwan.